Hey, what's up, everyone? It's Chris. Uh, at Gamescom today in Germany, Sony announced the PlayStation 3 Slim, or just officially the PlayStation 3. Um, and we just so happen to have one right here, brand new in the box. I have not opened it myself yet, so this is going to be new to me, but we're going to see what's inside. So, just looking at it real quick, it's fairly clean. has the, uh, you know, rumored, you know, kind of new look for the logo. Uh, 120 gig hard drive, so let's see what's in there. Box. We have DualShock 3, and here's a bunch of manuals. Throw those away. Power cable and component cable. No, sorry, just RCA video cable and a mini USB cable. So that's this bit. And. Here is the system, just cardboard and packaging inside of that. This. And there it is. So there is no external power supply, which is pretty cool. You just have a regular power cable, the same sort of thing you found on the PS2. So it just goes in the back here. So that's nice to know. Uh, you've got you know Ethernet, HDMI, optical audio out, and your regular multi-AV. And then, otherwise, I mean, it's pretty basic. One thing that I do not see, though, is a way to take the hard drive out to upgrade it like you would on the current PS3, which is a little disappointing. But, uh, and then here we have the existing PS3, so we can do a little side-by-side -side comparison here. They look to be pretty much the same length this way, so it's just shorter and a little bit thinner. If you look at it from the top, you can kind of see that it's it's not quite as fat, but uh, basically it's a height and uh, I guess width drop. Um, and weight-wise, it is definitely lighter. It still feels solid. Doesn't feel like it's you know stuff's moving around in there. The um, the power and eject buttons are now actual tactile buttons as opposed to the you know whatever this was before. Um, yeah, so there you go. Two USB ports in the front. PS3, PS3, not slim, PS3. Hey, we just got a quick update from Sony. You can swap out the hard drive. Here's the top, flip it over. There's a little thing here. This just pops up, kind of swings out of the way. There's your blue screw if you've done it before, it's the same color. That comes out and then the drive will slide out of here. So, you can upgrade the hard drive. Good to know.